carboxylic acid. So there are two types of uh, carboxylic acids okay, that are going to be oxidized. Okay, the first one is going to be uh, methanoic acid. So I'll just write down HCOOH. And second carboxylic acid that can actually undergo uh, this uh, oxidation is going to be the C double bond OOH and then C double bond OOH. So this is going to be methanoic acid and the other one is going to be ethane okay, dioic acid. Okay. So these two yeah, will undergo oxidation okay, under certain conditions. Yeah. So please remember, okay, this can undergo oxidation with KMnO4, okay, acidified K2Cr2O7 acidified. Okay, the same KKMnO4 acidified K2Cr2O7 acidified. Now, if there is a reaction, okay, we are expecting to see okay, your uh, potassium manganate, the pink color, okay, is going to become colorless. Okay, and we are going to see, okay, from here it's going to be orange to become green. Okay, so the same thing, okay, will be applying for uh for this side as well so i'll just copy and paste it over here okay now uh if okay for methanoic acid okay methanoic acid they are going to uh even undergo okay the reaction because they are said to be a strong reducing agent okay a strong reducing agent where they can really uh, react with mild oxidizing agent, which is going to be tolan. Okay, they can react with tolans region and failing solution as well. Okay, so tolans region and failing solution. Now for tolans region, yeah, tolan is actually being made. Okay, from uh um uh from Ag plus okay ions okay in ammonia solution yeah in ammonia solution okay so in ammonia so what happens okay in that reaction we are expecting the ag plus is going to change into ag so you are going to get a silver mirror precipitate okay so this presence of silver mirror precipitate is going to be appearing for methanoic acid when you test with tolan yeah and failing solution, okay, failing is made of copper uh, plus ion, okay, copper plus ion. So if you put the copper plus ion, okay, so what happens, okay, they are going to change into copper two plus, okay, uh, sorry, they are going to change, okay, from copper two plus, okay, they are going to change into copper plus, okay. And this is going to react with water. Okay, so you will have copper one, uh, copper one oxide. Yeah, copper one oxide. This is the one that will give you the brick red precipitate. Okay, brick red precipitate or orange precipitate. Okay, so uh, the blue color. Okay, the blue solution. Okay, they will change into brick red precipitate. Okay, because Okay, failing solution is a oxidizing agent. They will become reduced. You see plus two to become plus. Okay, the same Ag plus to become zero. Yeah, uh, plus one to become zero for Ag. So uh, this going to be, okay, all these reactions, okay, will happen, okay, with methanoic acid, okay. And do remember, okay, when you uh, test with tolan and failing, Normally, we use tolan and failing to test for aldehyde, okay, uh, so that I can um, I can compare, okay, so that I can compare between aldehyde and ketone, yeah, aldehyde and ketone because aldehyde can be further oxidized, so I can give you reaction for aldehyde. But now it can be also used, okay, to give you the positive test for methanoic acid. Okay, so uh, that is the part. Okay, if you do the same thing with tolan, okay, and uh, tolan 
and failing okay tolen and failing will not give you any reaction okay when you do the reaction with the uh, ethane dioic acid because tolen and failing is not strong enough okay to oxidize ethane dioic acid okay that is the first part 